I've won Treasure Clan and I've got something spicy. Uh, I don't know if anyone's done this before. Please let me know down below. I've combined Lugia with Noctowl, Terrapicos and Cornstone with Fan Rotom. I know. I know. It's crazy. It's crazy. I know. It's mad. Uh, with every zero. I mean, Lugia's always been a mishmash box, you know, a mess. You know, it's always its own problem is itself and its inconsistencies. But I was like, how can you address that? Not tell. Dual seeking ability. So the plan is go put down a Lugia. Use a body puffin to find a Rotom. And say a Hootoot or a Mincino. Probably a Hootoot. Then go fan call. Not tell. Whatever. Mincino. Whatever. Nesbor. Trapicos. Then have next turn when you do your not your uh not tell you can go not tell because you've got a terror pokemon or you can use cornerstone either one depending who you are i put the cornerstone in because you can use legacy energy with it with a double turbo and it has shred uh so it's not too bad it actually helps against other matchups and it's a wall as well so why not and the plan is to go dual seeker Find, say, Jacques. Jacques is normally the key card you want to go for. If you haven't thrown away an Archeops, an Ultra Ball. Or if, you have, if you've got an Ultra Ball, keep it. Go Jacques, area zero. Then use Jacques to get two Archeopses. Ultra Ball, the two Archeopses to get the Lugia V-Star. Slap down the Lugia V-Star. Put down the area zero. Make your bench bigger. Then throw, that, throw the two... Uh, discarded Archaeopsis onto the bench and then if you want to get rid of say the Not Town, the Hutoot and the Rotom in case you they're getting loads of damage and stuff you can with the Lugian discard the stadium so they can avoid giving your opponent extra prizes um, and we can attack with the Terrapagos and we can fill our board we've got so much Pokemon search it's really easy to go full board for Terrapicos to do 220 and it can do 240 now because um we can do like jet mist energy um from the archaeopsis so we don't have to keep using double turbos but it is there and we can use the cornerstone as well and we can attack with rotom as well it's crazy and you've got the Gino line it's nuts but it works and it's i don't have normally have a problem Going, Noctowl, use Jark, Ultra Ball, Lugia, two double Archaeopsis, turn two, bomb. Thank you very much. Area zero, knockout. Uh, please let me know how you get on. You can take a screenshot. You can use the deck list in the description below. Copy and paste straight into Pokemon to see live. And yeah, see you in the next part. See you. Right, Noctowl with Lugia. So we're going to put Fan Call up. Then the Lugia, and then go from there. We are going second. Of course, we're going second. Okay. Uh, ooh. Right. All right. So it is a gimme goal. If I could draw into a stadium, I can actually knock this out with the fan call with the fan road arm such a broken ability right okay so they've gone that and that jamming tower that don't affect us we don't care but it's a stadium in play now shouldn't have done that fan call all right uh you 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 Um, okay. Well, I missed on you. Ultra Ball, this. Um, I'm not getting rid of a double, double turbo. And get a Terrapagos. I didn't do a deck check. I should have done a deck check, actually. It's fine. Right, so I can do Bomb. No more Gimme Goal. 
Now, they might concede now um, because area zero. Um, I can go not tell now for Jacques and as long as I've got Jacques, of course. And then I've got an ultra ball ready, so I don't have to do that. So I could probably find another ultra ball. Um, and then I can probably just go ultra ball, bomb, bomb, bomb. Uh, or I can just go for an Iona. No, wait, no, it wouldn't have to be an Iona. It'd have to be something to find Lugia. So then, yeah. We'll see. And, hey, there we go. And they're going to pass. Nope, Nest Ball. Fez. Or Rotom. It's the Fez. So they're going to draw an extra three. There we go. Badoof. And what else are you going to do? Energy on you, of course. Pass. Pass. Pass, pass, pass. Cryptomaniac. Ah, setting yourself up for next turn. Are you now? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. It is a broken card that is though. Uh, I have built something that works around that. So you don't need Pidgeot. Um, but I can't bring it out yet until after uh, Lille Regionals. So, but when it does after that, I will do it. So it's fine. Okay, so I've got Area Zero. So we can go Area Zero. Bomb. Not Tau. Not Tau's Jewel Seeker to be a Will help me find what now? Jock. I'd like a boss to knock out the gimme gold, but it is what it is. Uh, and then. Yeah, that'll get me the Lugia. Uh, I would want. For next turn, the boss. Just in case. So I can go Jock. And go for double Archeops. Then the Archeops is going to be discarded with the Ultra Ball. See how it works. And then we can get a Lugia. Uh, Okie dokie. And that means I've got that. Then I can go Star. Uh, Summoning Star. Whoa. Ha. Have I cracked the code? For this deck. I don't know. I think I have. Right. Okay. So. Uh, I could knock this out with. Roof. Uh, let's see. If I just retreat this. Going to trap goes. How much am I doing? One six. That's enough to knock that out. Okay. Uh, and then I can go for. Uh, let's see. Let's get juiced up. Um, that and that onto the Lugia. So we get two on the Lugia. Then I can do another Primal Turbo and get something on the Gicino. Uh I will put... I'm going to save a Double Turbo. I've got a Double Turbo in hand. No, I don't. Uh, I'm going to put a Gift Energy on to just one onto the Mincino in case they go after it. Then I can go 160, knock this out. Puts me to even prizes. So Trap Ghost is an attacker. Okay. So I replaced the Raikou. I did have a Raikou. I replaced it with Trap Ghost. So three. So then I can start with it a little bit easier. So then I can do the combo with the Noctowl and. So the Fang Call, Noctowl, and Trap Ghost. Well, no. So the fan call will summon the Hoot Hoots and get me the Noctow in hand. I should have a Trap Ghost in hand because I have three in the deck. And I should be able to find it either with just drawing into it naturally or an Espor or Capturing Aroma. Uh, and with the 3-3 three, three Lugia, I should be able to find that as well. So it kind of helps either way. And we're not worried about bench space now because we've got area zero. Um, so... This person's going to knock out this Drapagos. Okay, I know that. 
but can I do something here? I need. I have got an orchard ball. I um, might have to do to Ch Minchino here. Mind you, I only need to put three energies on there, so it's not too bad. Uh, I'm going to have to get rid of this boss, though. I don't want to get rid of the boss, but I might have to get rid of the boss. Now, they're going to take two prizes. Then we could take two prizes with the Minchino. Or Chichino. Uh, have I got... Did I throw one away? No. But I have got three energies in the disc bar, which I do not like. Because they are limited resources. Uh, so then, we can go for... Right. Oh, I was just thinking to myself, maybe I save the boss or use the boss to get the fez. And then I use the fez to knock out the fez with the Lugia. Save them in China, make them go to odd prizes, then knock them out with them in China to get the last prize. I might do that actually. But they could do uh, Polkia and then do a Greninja to knock me out and knock out my Minchino. That's a problem. Mm. Yeah. But then I'd lose the boss as well. Um, what should I do here? A lot of trap goes. Then I've got to get rid of you. Okay. And then I will put... Uh, it is the only... Big threat. But the Greninja is a real threat. How many... Yeah. They've got... They could do a Greninja. So I'm going to have to do... Whatever our top draw. If it's a Chinchino. Oh, that's just beautiful. Oh, that's beautiful. I don't want to use the boss now. I want to just knock this out. Um, So, I will go... Uh, one, two... And then... Double turbo onto... No, we don't need to do double turbo. We're just going to do a jet. Do one. There we go. I've got another Lugia and something else. I don't want to get, knock anything else out. I just want to go even prizes, bro. So now we are ahead. Right? And if they knock this out, they go to odd prizes. Now with the Lugia, if I'd left it as a Chin Chin Minchino, they could have gone Greninja, Shuriken, and then knocked it out. And that would have messed up my next attack. Um, so I've got a gust. If I keep my hand of one, if I can keep the boss in my hands of one, um, but that's only if I keep what I've got in my hands. Now, you've seen what I've done here. Uh, and when I lose the Tropicos and the Area Zero is not working, we can actually get damaged Pokemon off the bench. So instead of getting rid of, like, say, the Rotom and that, we could have got rid of the Noctowl or something that they put damage counters on, and it helps clear our board. So we're only using the Area Zero to use it for Tropicos. And I've left the space for Tropicos. But also, I've left the space for Blood Moon and so Luna. And why is that? Because Blood Moon and Saluna is a big, chunky Pokemon that can do 240. And, yeah. It's a good beat stick. Let's put it that way. Uh, so, we always like to keep one bench open. Uh, that's how I've been finding and learning with this deck. It has took me a while to get the ratios right with this deck. Um, but I haven't... The only thing I don't like is that I've only got two bosses when I would like three. Uh, three boss is really nice. Pin that we are very discard happy. Uh, they've got a Bidoof. 
They got a Bowel, Palkia. So I told you they would have Palkia. And if they did Star Portal and done a Greninja, they could have knocked out this, this little... Uh, it would have been a Chinchino then. Uh, well, it wouldn't have been because I top doored into a Chi Chinchino. But if they gussed it up and knocked it out before I could actually take a KO... Oh, no. They best give me a million or something to search that best be a tails. <laughs> if I get a tails, I'm good. Okay. Oh, I'm hoping this gift energy is going to give me a boss. Give me a boss. Boss. It's not a boss, but it gives me an option to find a boss. There's the Lugia. And I forget this is a one prize as well. Research. Okay, let's just hope on the tiles. See, it works when you pray. <laughs> you have to pray. And then it works. Okay, so we've got the Lamillion. Okay. Uh, and we could go for, if we go, uh, two energies onto this, we'll just go gift and that straight onto this. So we do 220, then we can go Lamillion. and we have got the, f have I got the Fez in here? I don't think I've got the Fez, but I can get the boss. Then the boss would find me this lovely person and that is game. And that is how... Lugia, not Tower to Apicos, works. See you in the next part. See you. Not Tower, Lugia. Go with Tarapicos. Uh, we'll start with Tarapicos. And if we're going first, we're not going first. And what was that? Right. Vacuum. Give me that. Let's see. Future. Cancelling. Oh dear. I know what it is. I know what it is as well. Oh dear. Okay. Iron Fawns. Mmm. And I can't attack next turn, but they might be able to. Alright. Okay. Right, we'll get that down. I would like a Lugia, but I've got no Kanzen Cologne in this deck. So. I need to fill out as well. Um, and I need to get a Noctowl, you, and you. So, double that. Uh, I'm not using you yet, so I'm going to get the... Uh, if I get the Chichino, uh, yeah, I'm going to get you down. And then uh, I will put Gift Energy on you and pass. And then what I can do, if I can fill out the board, I can one-shot this Iron Thorns. Don't be heads. Damn you! <laughs> Iron Thorns! I loathe you. I loathe you. That's a double turbo as well. If I kept that energy i could have done 240 i could have filled the board and they know that and i need another iron thorns with one catcher head what are they going to go for okay 
Ah, sie bitte neu. Chinchino, what to you? Not I'm only getting one not at this, so uh, we need to make it a good one. Uh, area zero, one hundred percent. I need something to draw more instead of a boss and an eye owner. I need to refresh my hand as well, and I don't want to throw anything away as well. So I've got to do this in the right order now. Uh, if I get... Um, if I've got another Chinchino here. I have got a Chinchino. Right, we'll get another Chinchino. Right. Then I'll go Area 0. And then I'm going to go Iona. And hopefully find a Double Turbo. I did find a Double Turbo, which is great. Um... That's 130. And then I can go you and you. Uh, and we will get another trap ghost. Right. I could have attached with the Rotom, to be fair. Now they have to definitely bench a Pokemon. Um, no radar. That's two. Right. And they can attack. And they can put a double turbo onto this. Process orders. Ah, they're going for the Chichinos. So they are taking the prizes. Yeah, that's fine. Okay. Right, is 70 enough? 40? It is exactly enough. You want to mess with me? I'm going to mess with you. I have the fan Rotom. You have nothing. You have nothing. Caption Aroma. Tails. Great. Uh, and we'll get a... It's going to have... Oh. It's going to have to be a Lugia. And I need more Pokemon on the bench. So I'm going to have to do research. Okay. And I've got more Pokemon there. Chichino. Then I can go... Assault. And take two prizes. They have a two card hand by the way. Uh, but I've managed to do something against them. There's another double turbo, so I can put another double turbo on the Trapagos. They've got two card hand, but I bet any money they've got research. Like, of course they'd have the lightning energy. I was hoping they wouldn't, but they did. Arvon, and is that going to be enhanced hammer? Crushing hammer. Right. Are they going to go for it? They are. If they get heads again, it's really it's so annoying. They get all the luck, the iron forms with these crushing hammers. They've done two and they've got both and the heads on that as well. Oh, when people get so lucky sometimes, it's really annoying. And I've had to play in a certain way because I can't do my summoning star. Okay, and they're going to get a prize off that. There goes more Pokemon down the drain. So I'm going to have to promote the... Um... Yeah, because I can't one-shot it. Okay, 
Uh, and then we're going to go double turbo on you. Um, on you. I'm doing 100. I'm going to have to... Yeah, I didn't want to do that, but it's... 130. And if they've got a penny, I'll be so annoyed. Play top draw into that, by the way. Oh, come on. That's a joke. Onto that. So that's got almost everything it needs. Right. Okay. 130. Knock this out. Right. Okay. All I need is... I wouldn't mind a legacy energy here. Oh, it's another type of turbo. Right. Uh, I know these Lugias are a big threat. But they are... Oh, you're joking. They, this person is literally top drawing into every single card they need. And what makes things worse, they are actually finding... They, literally every coin flip they're getting right they're getting this right they're getting that right well you can have that that's fine with me 160 okay um all right so we've got a double turbo there um i am going to do a silane for this and this no the mist. Yeah, I just want to. Don't want to draw any more. That's a shock. Okay. And I can do a hundred to the U. Right. Hmm. Right, I've knocked that out. It's really annoying. Uh, yeah. There's another Lugia. Um, Right, I need to find. I can't knock. I can't knock him out. That's so annoying. And I'm giving them a chance here as well. They only need a gust card to win. They need one gust, and this person has hit every single Pokemon catcher. And if anyone, he's got Prime catcher. He's got. He's hit every single Pokemon catcher there is. Every single one. It's best be tails. Are you joking me? He has hit every single one. Heads. Right. What else has he hit? Um, this is a joke. Right. We're going to go right back on. We're going to review this. This person. Right. And I'm using Lugia, which is a really bad matchup. Heads, Pokemon Catcher. All right. Then they do, uh, let's see, let's see, let's see. They top draw into a course to see the final of the, uh, the double turbo and the collapse stadium. Right. That means then I can't do the damage I need to do to knock him out. Okay. And then not just that as well. Right. Pokemon Catcher. Heads. Right. Then they get another head off the crushing hammer. Okay. Then, which it's more insult to me as well, and just pure, just 
Nutty, another head on a Pokemon Catcher, right? And a head on a, a Crushing Hammer. Come on, I would have won that. This is why I built it, so that if we didn't couldn't use the Lugia, we could use the Trapicos to knock him out. And it hasn't happened because they keep getting lucky with these head calls. And it's just pure luck. It's not anything else but pure luck. Right, so we go to another match and I'll knock it out. Lugia. Go! Well, we ain't got a bad hand, to be honest with you. Uh, yeah. Let's just see. Oh, it's not too bad. Let's see what we get off this. And then we'll go from there. Heads. Well, it will be an Archaeops. So then I can discard that. Um, right, okay. So, I can go you, you. Okay. Um, fan call for Nuttail, Hoot Hoot, Minchino. Um, uh, and then Ultra Ball, the Archaeops, and the Hoot Hoot. Oh, what have we got here? Mmm. I want another Luminion. I do want another... Sorry, not Luminion. Lugia. Because I can see them knocking something out. I've got a Jet Energy. I've got a Mist Energy. Mm, they could knock it out. But I need to get one of these out. So then I've got that benched. And then I'm going to put a Mist on you. And go from there. And hope they can't go Roy Moo. Uh, that's all I can hope for at this point. Um, it was either take the Trap Coast or put a Lugia down. If I did Lugia, I couldn't do a Noctowl. And I've only got one uh, Archaeops in there. Now, they've gone attached to... Was that attached? That is mainly attached. Pokemon Catcher. Tails, Tails always fails. Trust me, I have had some matches against this and it's a nightmare. Right, okay, so there's the Hutu. Okay. Uh, so. Um, mm, I'm going to, wait. Oh, no. Oh, fuck it. Fine. All right, so then we're going to go um, Shark Ultra Ball. Yeah, I, could, I need Stadium, don't I, though? Mm, I do need the Stadium. I need the Stadium to do what I need, but I need the Ultra Ball to get rid of that to get the extra Archaeops going. But I can get the Lugia going. Um, so I'm going to have to go Archaeops U. And I misplayed by putting that there, by the way. And then I can go for this and this. And get a Lugia. What? No, wait. Why did I get a Lugia? And I can't do so many sides. I'm going to let him knock that out. Sod it. I completely messed up there. I didn't mean to grab the Lugia. I meant to grab... Uh, a Chinchino. Then evolve Chinchino. Um, yeah, I... I don't know what was going on with my brain then for a second. So they've gusted up the Noctowl. Fair enough. But now, I have got a Minchino. I should have had a Chinchino, but I didn't do it. I should just grab the Chinchino from the Ultra Ball. So then I would have Chinchino. And then if they knock this out, 
then I can knock them out with the Chinchino um, and save the Lugia. And then that would give me space for Archeops. Now, they probably won't want to knock anything out. Oh, okay. So I have to Iona now. Oh, uh, mm, 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 mm. Oh, I, mm, no, just Iona. It's tempting. Not what I want, but it's not too bad. Uh, okay. What could I get here? I could get... Just this. Oh. Um, I'm going to bench another Lugia and then do nothing. And let them see if they can knock this out. Um, I just need to find one card. And that is area zero. Now, I couldn't do it with what I had in my hand. If I'd saved an Ultra Ball. Yeah, I should have saved an Ultra Ball. At the start there. So then I could combine it with Chuck. To find the area zero. And I've completely misplayed there. But I do have missed energy on this. So that does shut down the frenzy gouging. But it doesn't stop them from doing 220. But I am protected by that. So. Hmm. And having the mist energy on the trap goes. And on the Lugias. Just make it a little bit easier. Um, but if I can find a double turbo. I'm not doing too bad. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> so we can start. Thank you very much. Oh, no. I do have some Hoot Hoots. Oh, no. Hoot Hoots there. Uh, what else do I have in the deck? Uh, I've got another Lugia. I'm probably going to go for another Trap Ghost in case you try and knock it out. Uh, I can go. I do want to go Mist. Mm, no. I've got no Ch Minchino, so I can't knock it out yet. So I do want to go Mist on you as well. Then I can go two on you. Actually, no, I can go double turbo on you. Uh, so I'm just going to do a double turbo onto the Lugia. Because I'm not knocking this out, right? I'm not knocking it out going first, okay? So I am going to charge up um, a Terrapagos. Conserve some of the energies. Okay, and now I could do 200. And this person is having a really bad start. And no, I do not want to discard this yet. I kind of want to keep it. So I can choose when to discard this if your opponent doesn't get rid of it. That's the whole point of this deck. Is say I had a Lugia or a Trapagos or something with loads of damage. And it's almost... And you're playing against a Dragapult or something like that. And they are going after your really weak Pokemon. So they put 60 on this or 30, 40... On this, yeah? So they put 40 and 30 on this. Or on this. And they're going to knock it out. And you don't want them to have that prizes. You could use your Lugia to get rid of the Area Zero. Which allows you, it's kind of like Collapse Stadium. To get rid of all your damaged Pokemon. But keep the Pokemon you want to keep. So I would keep, say, in that scenario. I would keep Archeops. Archeops. Uh, probably a... A Lugia or a, a, a Terra Pokemon. And they've completely scooped. And I don't see how they could have had such a bad hand. I don't understand. But I'll get to show you how this deck works. So we go to another match. and So as you can see. Uh, this deck really does work. It's got everything it can do. You can see how the Noctowl will help complement the Lugia. To get the Archaeopsis out. Because you can search for two any trainer cards. Which could be an Ultra Ball and a Shark. 
Uh, if you need an area zero, then you need an area zero. Um, and it's there just to help you out. Now, I'm not the best with uh, Lugia and stuff like that. I admit that. I don't really play Lugia that much. But I thought I could make this, make it good. And it works. Now, so for that last match, right? That last match. Well, no. That match with the Iron Thorns. The luckiest player I've ever gone against. They got every single heads. And it was about five or six times. It was like three Pokemon catchers. And like two Christian Hammers. Five heads in a row. And it's the only reason they beat me. Because all I had to do was knock out next turn. That is it. And if they couldn't have gusted up. I would have knocked out the Iron Thorns. So. Yeah. A bit salty, but still. So, don't forget to hit that like, subscribe, and everything else, and all that jazzy stuff, and try this deck out, and let me know how you get on, and is this a new way to play Lugia? I don't know. You tell me. I'll see you in the next one. See you then.